Another scam warning, this time for drivers. You may want to think twice before scanning a QR code in a parking lot or at a parking meter. QR codes are meant to make life easier in a digital world, but some stickers attached to pay and display parking machines across the nation are leading some to pay parking fees to the wrong place, and it's been linked to Russia. News Nation's Nancy Liu is live in Redondo Beach, California. And Nancy, there are reports of this happening across the nation, and they're in California. That's right, Nicole, and something the Better Business Bureau has sounded multiple warnings about, but new scams keep popping up to trick new victims. Here in Redondo Beach, fake QR code stickers have been removed from about 150 parking meters. The legitimate stickers have a small QR code leading to a vendor called Park Mobile. Another option for drivers is payment through an app. But just a few weeks ago, more than 100 meters also had a large QR code sticker below. And scanning that led to a fake website. Instead of pay by phone, it was Poi by phone, and victims who entered their credit card and financial information, they got scammed. Another criminal scheme here in Southern California, fake parking tickets. Police in Alhambra recently warned about fake citations with a QR code. That also led to a scam website. Examples of the city's real citations do not have a QR code. Now, it's not clear how many people fell victim or what they lost, but in California alone, scam QR codes have also been removed in San Francisco, Bakersfield, San Diego, and San Clemente. Nicole? Oh, my goodness, yeah, those fake tickets, the fake parking tickets. So, so Nancy, we know it's not just happening in California. Where else are they seeing this? Well, we know that other cities where scam QR codes have surfaced include Nashville and Akron, Ohio. Fake stickers have also surfaced uh, nabbing unsuspecting victims in England and Canada. QR code scams, they're known as quishing. Uh, that's QR code phishing. And it's popping up more because criminals know it works. And according to law enforcement, there are links to Russia. In Sunrise, Florida, Police just released this video to warn drivers to think twice about scanning QR codes or downloading apps that may look suspicious. And best course, Nicole, don't scan a QR code unless you know it's legitimate. Absolutely. Nicole. All right, Nancy Lou, thank you. Thanks for watching. Go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your screen. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.